York. Oh, I told you. Why, hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Deadly Premonition, the director's cut. Let's get straight back into it. Episode 3, Hidden Memories. Let's go. Documents from a case that happened 50 years ago. Let's play along with the old man for a little longer, shall we? Sure. Zack, that means we need to head for the sheriff's department. We don't have to do anything on toward, do we? Uh, why do we have to drive there? Why could you just take me there? Realism or something? <laughs> well, thanks. We get out of the previous cutscene and it's just like, Oh no, you can drive back. It's not nice of us. No. <laughs> no, it's not. All right. Back to the sheriff's office, but we really need to stop by the gas station. <laughs> That's uh, not looking that so good. Uh. What is going on with my car? <laughs> Yay, gas station. Oh, it's him. He's got to spit on my car and be a jerk. Mm. Ah, the mouth noises. Ah. Or if we'll bring me a Ben Franklin or two. And off he goes. <laughs> Screw you. All those bumps and crashes. And she just goes. <sighs> and wipes them out. <laughs> just, just that good. We. Alrighty. We're here. Come on. Story. Give me that story. Can there really be documents here that the FBI doesn't even have? What do you think, Sam? Probably, yeah. I mean, the FBI doesn't have files from every single part of America. Right? York! Oh! I told you! That's nothing more than local folklore! He's angry at me! It's York! Harry said <laughs> that he was there. The raincoat killer if is any of us should be angry, it should be me, buddy. Ago. You have killed people in this Harry. investigation. All people. I agree with George. Harry likes to play with people. Mm. Play with their minds. Give me your files. I'm from the FBI. I outrank you. Give me your files. George. Emily. Of course I don't believe him word for word. Give me the files. But you won't mind if I at least try to confirm that he's wrong, will you? <laughs> Unless you're hiding something. Don't make well, me shake that mustache right off your face. By yourself? I'm still looking for Thomas. Thomas Fair still enough. hasn't showed up? That's a little Emily, disconcerting. Open the filing room for him. Why are you so confident one minute and then such a little, like, oh, kind of hold my arm and be all stressed? The next, like, either you have the PTSD or you don't, Emily. What? <laughs> They're here too, Zach. They're in the sheriff's office. This might mean we're getting warmer to what we need. Maybe. Where did Emily go? Hey. Emily, is that you? Emily, put down the pipe. <laughs> Emily? Emily, don't make me shoot you, Emily. Emily, put down the pipes. Emily, no! <laughs> Emily, did you get a haircut or something? Emily, put out the shotgun. You shooting at Emily? See the shotgun? See? <laughs> See how the shotgun works? Bitch! <laughs> Is the killer gonna be here too? Hello? Is this one of these running things? Hmm. 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 Zoom right in on that sexy face. Oh no, we're gonna profile? Wait, what? I thought this only happened when there was a mower door. What is this? Let me guess. Zach, we don't have enough information or clues. We're gonna have to look around a bit more. Too much noise. We're still missing a vital piece <laughs> of the puzzle. Gotta get them clues. Yeah. Casually walk away from them. <laughs> A red seed, eh? Hmm? 
Oh, it's not just, just like, bro, I'm just gonna go right to this desk here. <laughs> nice of the enemies just, like, not bother me while I was picking that up and profiling, you know? That was very considerate of you guys. Thank you. 1955, 1956. Something has been removed. Hmm. Naughty, naughty. Someone's been breaking into the safe. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> that was really good. I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. <laughs> This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Look at this. <laughs> Don't watch. Don't even have to move my aim. <laughs> oh, here comes another one. Oh, so deadly. And then bam. Oh, no, guys. What's going to happen? I think an enemy's going to come here. And then I'm going to go. Uh, bam. <laughs> oh, I fucked it up. I fucked up the pattern. Yay. Now I'm getting... Fisted again! Oh, it's so gross. <laughs> Sometimes I think York likes it. Give me a sword, panda bear! I'm missing a clue somewhere. I'm gonna have to just go over everything again. Where be the final clue? I'm generally feeling a bit silly here. What do they want me to do? I've gone in and out of those two rooms. It's not in either of them gone back. I can't go forward. And I'm missing one clue. Where's the clue I'm missing? Alright. If I go into the right, I've rubbed every myself up against everything in this path, right? So it can't be this way. Now if I go into this side, there's a big old empty square, right? Nothing here. Alright. Go into here. Is the room with the seed. I checked around here. I observed. Thomas is missing. Yada, yada, yada. Something in one of these walls? No. Okay. Then that leads back here. To where am I meant to go? I don't get it. I don't get what's going on. Okay, we may have a serious, serious problem. I just looked up where the clue is because I ran around for over an hour and a half looking for the clue. And... It's not where it's supposed to be in my game. It's supposed to be in that room that I was running around in with all the files. I'll show you now. It's supposed to be in here on the shelf. But... The shelves don't have the icon. What do I do? There's no... There's no icon to examine them. It's supposed to be here, but it isn't here. I think the game's genuinely broken. There's not even a prompt when I rub myself up against it. Uh, what do I do? <laughs> Guys, I think this might actually be the end of our playthrough. I've, I've looked around. <laughs> um, it's definitely meant to be in this room. <laughs> That's extremely depressing, guys. I was really enjoying this game. Um, if I can get a save file or some sort of bug fix for this, um, I'll try. But other than that, this, this is it. Um, I can't progress, I can't go back, I can't get the final clue, so, yeah, there's no point stalling anymore. Until I figure out how to fix this, guys, or if someone tells me how to fix it, that's it. It's over. Oh, that's so depressing, what a lame way to end this. Oh, change my clothes. Hope that helps, <sighs> go for a sleep, hope that helps, I don't know. Maybe I'll refresh the area. Hmm. <laughs> and the sign will appear that allows me to actually pick it up. I just want to get the clue, man. I want to continue playing the game. <laughs> don't make me... Don't make me stop playing. I want to keep playing. Uh, and if I... Because you see, if I go through all the previous chapter and this one again... And I get to here, and it's still bugged. I genuinely would be so angry. <laughs> I can't put myself through that. Oh, no. Deadly premonition. Please don't be broken still. Oh, you're still broken. 
You're still broken. There's no, there's no thing to pick up. There's supposed to be a thing. I'm supposed to be able to like find dried water or whatever here, but there is no dried water. There's no icon. The game's broken. It's over. It's done. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'd like to thank everybody who's been watching me this whole time, and hopefully you were enjoying it up to this point. I'm, oh, I can't believe this is where it's gonna end. This is so lame. There's nothing else I can do. I've looked up bug fixes. There doesn't seem to be anything I can do. I've fooded about. This is the second day of trying to fix it, and I just... Ah, I can't keep doing it. It's over. It's just an infinite loop because it's broken. Uh, well, I'd like to thank you all again very much for watching. Oh, it's so disheartening. <laughs> and I'll see all you beautiful people next time in a more stable series. Bye-bye!